Hello, and welcome to another very depressing, heartbroken, musicless Zach Roberts. I, as always, am the depressed host, Zach Roberts. Now, if you actually care, you may be asking, why would he be depressed? I'm just going to tell you, I'm going to tell you that right now. This guy that I knew, well, I didn't know him personally, but I knew who he was, passed away yesterday of a massive heart attack. He was 50 years old. Any guesses? Ding, ding, Michael Jackson. I grew up with this guy entertaining me. He entertained me while I grew up. Beat It, Thriller, Billy Jean, some of the best songs I can remember and some of the best moments I can remember. There was always a Michael Jackson song playing in the background. And he passed away. He died of a massive heart attack. So did Farrah Fawcett, but she had cancer. We were kind of expecting that. And so did Ed McMahon. And you know, my grandpa once said, celebrities and famous people always die in three. Now that means that if one celebrity dies, you know two others are going to die soon. And that happened. Ed McMahon died, like, we'll just say Ed McMahon died Wednesday, Farrah Fawcett died early Thursday, and then Michael Jackson died Thursday. And, you know, I wish that we would have treated Michael Jackson better as a country. Uh, because we, ta we, we said that he molested and was a pedophile. When he probably wasn't. I can't tell you if he was or if he wasn't because I don't know the dude personally. But I'm telling you, that is not him. It, I, yeah, that was a tear. I, I can't picture him doing that. And I'm glad I can't picture him doing that because that would be gross. But I can't see this loving guy who just wants to have a good time and stay a child forever could ever do that. And we put him in to such a bad position that he was like a freak and nobody wanted to see him. And did you know that tomorrow, well, that would be today, he wanted to, he was going on a world tour, a comeback tour. But he died before he got the chance. You see, I think that if we had treated him better, he wouldn't have taken... He, uh, well, I mean, the autopsy results haven't even been released yet. But when they are, I'm almost guaranteed that it will be because he was addicted to painkillers. Poor Michael Jackson. We forced him to become white. We forced him... In, into this freak of nature kind of guy. And that's not who he was. And now he's dead, and we all regret it. And I woke up this morning, and I said, okay, as a tribute to Michael Jackson, I'm going to play Guitar Hero World Tour and play Beat It. And I did. And I felt a little bit better because I was playing a tribute to Michael Jackson, which is what he would have wanted. He also would have wanted a better life, but I'm not going to get into that. So for Austin's X00, and an installment of my vlog, and my vlog, not an installment, that should have been said at the beginning, I am Zach Roberts. And to all you Michael Jackson fans out there who are mourning the loss of Michael Jackson, I'm with you. He was too young to die, and he shouldn't have. America lost a great pop star and a great dancer, and we will never get him back. He was an all-around great man. And now that the logo's up, I want to show. I want to. I, I just want to share a little tidbit about myself. Yeah, I got contacts. <gasps> you see, isn't it totally different? <laughs>